What's up everybody? Thanks for coming in. This video is a practical review of Deathblade. I'm a Korean Lost Ark user who played over 2000 hours. And today, we'll be watching how real Deathblade is like. This is Deathblade. In short, Deathblade is a back attack dealer with charge skills. Deathblade has 4 main damage skills. 3 charge skills and 1 holding skill. So, what's important for this class is to use your charge skills as fast as possible at the back of your opponent. Yeah, and we all know charging skills must be charged before using it, and it takes time to charge. This feature makes Deathblade a lost lower than the other classes, but it is one of a kind experience to watch it getting faster and faster as your character grows up. Next, let's look at the identity. Simply, you get a gauge when you hit the mob with your skill. You can stack to 3 orbs with your identity. When you activate your identity by pressing Z, you can get extra cooldown with attack power and agility depending on the number of orbs you stack. Pressing Z again will also activate a powerful attack. As this class needs orbs to get extra buff, we need specialization stat to increase its efficiency. Specialization also increases the damage of burst damage. Your identity skill. The more, the better. Now let's look at class engravings and what kind of skills they use. First, Dancing Explosion. 9 out of 10 Korean Deathblade users choose this engraving. This engraving gives you a buff after using the burst. It increases 12% movement speed, attack speed, as well as attack power by 12%, 24%, 36% depending on the number of orbs you stack. It's great both in PvP and PvE. 8 skills below are commonly used. These are tripods I used for the skill tree. Some tripods are replaceable, but these tripods are already tested in Korean server and are best ways to maximize the damage. Basic rotations are Spin Cutter, Milestorm, Blitz Rush, Soul Absorber, and Void Strike. Moonlight Sonic is a skill that has no extra back attack damage, so you can use whenever you want. Axel is a, is a skill that is good for positioning. Earth Slash is a counter and staggering skill that you can use anytime you need. But if you are in a raid, such as Valtan, that has a gimmick of counter, you can use Earth Slash to counter it. Second class engraving is Firm Will, in other words, Burst. Unlike before, Firm Will is an all-for-one skill. While activating your identity, you can stack up to 20 by using skills. The more you fill your stacks, the more your burst damage increases. After the burst, orbs are regained depending on stacks you filled. In Burst skill tree, two things are different. Instead of Moonlight Sonic, we use Wind Cut. Also, Void Strike's tripods changed. Basic rotations are Milestorm, Flash Blink, Earth Flash, then Wind Cut, Z, Wind Cut. Spin Cutter, Soul Absorber, Void Strike, Milestorm, Blitz Rush, Spin Cutter, Wind Cut, and Burst.
if you only have about 273 skill points or at the average use the skill trees below for recommendation that blade is class which is more like a sword master than assassin this class can be difficult for some people if you are just starting this game However, if you're willing to overcome some difficulties and love this class using three swords, I guarantee this class will give you a great experience as your character grows. Thank you for watching this video and please leave a chat if you have any kind of questions.